Hello and welcome to IBD School. My name is Peter Higgins. I'm a clinician and researcher at the University of Michigan. In this video, IBD School 325, we will talk about the gut selective steroid budesonide. Budesonide is often referred to as a designer steroid or a gut selective steroid. It is designed to be absorbed in the wall of the gut and act in the wall of the gut with only a small amount reaching the bloodstream. When budesonide does get into the bloodstream, it is mostly broken down by the liver, so you get very little systemic exposure to the drug. This means that you will experience a lot less of the systemic side effects that are associated with steroids like prednisone. You can learn more about systemic steroid side effects in IBD School video 323. Budesonide is typically given in 9 mg doses daily via an oral tablet. In general, we say that about 9 mg of budesonide is equivalent to about 20 mg of prednisone in terms of steroid benefits, and equivalent to about 2.5 mg of prednisone in terms of side effects. There are two different release formulas for budesonide with the brand names Entocort EC and Eucerus. Entocort EC is given in 3 mg tablets that are usually taken as 3 tablets in the morning. Entocort's tablet size of 3 mg allows for dose adjustment or for slowly tapering off the drug. It is taken in the morning for two reasons. One being because one of the side effects of steroids is difficulty in falling asleep. The other reason is that the adrenal glands produce cortisol, a natural steroid, in the morning which is what helps us wake up and morning dosing of budesonide matches our normal circadian rhythm of cortisol. Entocort is released in the last part of the small intestine called the ileum. The ileum is one of the most common locations of inflammatory activity in Crohn's disease. A fair amount of entocort still reaches the colon, especially the right side of the colon, so it can provide some benefit to patients with colitis, but the drug is designed for the treatment of ileal Crohn's disease. Eucerus, the other formulation of budesonide, is primarily used for patients with ulcerative colitis. Eucerus comes only in 9 mg tablets that are taken once a day, usually in the morning. It is formulated to release throughout the colon, making it especially effective for ulcerative colitis. And that is why the name Eucerus starts with UC. Both Eucerus and Enercort are designed to offer rapid relief, with patients seeing effects usually within a week. Although they have reduced side effects compared to a systemic steroid like prednisone, Eucerus and Enercort still have side effects, and the longer you take them, the more side effects you will experience. Budesonide formulations are used for moderate flare-ups that would not send patients to the hospital. Budesonide is used to control mild to moderate flares before they become severe enough to land patients in the hospital. In most cases, if the flare is caught early enough, patients will see relief and not end up in the hospital. Unfortunately, a lot of patients only call for help once a flare is severe and it is often a little too late to use budesonide. Budesonide can be a fairly expensive drug depending on your insurance and which pharmacy you go to. It can be worth shopping around at different pharmacies and online to find a reasonable price. Because of pricing, colitis patients will sometimes see insurance companies recommend taking Entocort, which is usually less expensive, rather than Eucerus. Studies have shown that Eucerus is more effective than Entocort at treating ulcerative colitis flare-ups. However, Entocort can still help colitis patients. It will just not be as quite as effective as Eucerus. Budesonide is a gut-selective steroid. Just like any other steroid, it should not be used to replace your maintenance medication. The longer you take budesonide, the more steroid side effects you will experience. You can learn more about the side effects of steroids in IBD School video 323. I'm Peter Higgins, and thank you for watching IBD School.